Many experts agree an economic recession is imminent in the wake of COVID-19. The Montana Ag Network's Lane Nordland shares how a recession may impact the state's cattle ranchers. In a recession, beef is more volatile than grain and other staple food products. Montana State University College of Agricultural Economics professor Anton Beckerman said producers can look to the 2008 recession as an indicator. The 2008 recession was also very much a consumer-driven recession. We had the housing market bubble pop and a lot of consumers lo losing a lot of equity, a lot of disposable income and spending power. And so uh, a lot of consumers pulled back on buying, especially those luxury goods, which include beef. Dr. Beckerman said there's multiple ways to assess the 2008 recession's impact on the cattle markets. The most efficient approach is to use demand indices, which attempt to separate demand-related changes from contemporaneous supply dynamics. Take away the supply side of the market and only try to focus on what is going on with consumers. And what we saw happen in 2008 is as soon as that recession started to hit, we saw a drop in the demand for both all f uh, cuts of fresh meat and the choice cuts of beef. We saw that going down and going down and going down and right around end of 2010, beginning of 2011, we started to see those indices go up. We see this prolonged impact on consumers who are recovering after especially a longer recession like we saw in 2008. We actually didn't see the demand recover for beef back to pre-2008 levels until about 2015. That seven-year recovery period showed lower demand at the retail level ultimately trickles down to the processors, fed cattle, and feeder cattle markets, resulting in lower prices and decreased sales for cow-calf producers. Looking ahead, Dr. Beckerman has these tips. Know your cost of production. If you know what it takes to break even down to the animal, you're going to be that much better off either making sure that you're not in the red or making sure that you can go to that bank and get that operating loan. Certainly knowing cost of production and being really as aggressive as possible in tracking what happens to the market. Other management strategies Dr. Beckerman suggests include livestock risk protection insurance or cautiously using a market-based approach with futures or options markets. Reporting, Lane Nordland. MTN News.